Hi everyone. Now we will learn how we can add and use Bootstrap with Laravel. See, there are lots of other methods also to use and uh, add Bootstrap with the Laravel. But here we will talk about easiest and simplest way for that. And doesn't matter which Bootstrap version you want to use with the Laravel. It may be a Bootstrap 4, 5 or maybe some upcoming version. So this technique will work with the all of the versions. Right. And there is a very important thing which is Laravel layout. So if you are not aware like what is Laravel layout, how we can make it, then I'll suggest you to watch last part of this series. And there I told you like how we can use uh, layout with the component in Laravel. Because there we basically create a common page and that page is basically used with the all of the screens so that we can show the common code, common content and common style and all. All right. So uh, layout is very important for this. So we will continue with the last part there we created three pages, uh, login, home and about page. All right. And uh, after that we will add uh, bootstrap 5 CSS and JS in our layout file. Then we'll try some components for bootstrap and we'll discuss some important interview question also. This is the Laravel 11 uh, tutorial playlist. That will definitely help you out for Laravel job, project and interviews. You can access this playlist from the description box of this part. All right. So let me open uh, one more tab there and put there bootstrap 5 CDN or CDN 5, whatever you want to put. After that, you will find there. This is the CSS link for uh, bootstrap CDN and this is a JS link. So let me copy this CSS first and we'll paste it inside the layout.blade.php. So maybe you can just put it after title and after that let's include the JS also. Right. So now after that if you refresh your page you will just find out the UI is little bit got changed. Font family and everything right. So let me refresh home as well as about. So there you can uh, see the difference. So if you still not sure like uh, your bootstrap is added or not then maybe you can go to the inspect element and then here you can see that link and script tag if they are present and they are working fine you can just open in the new tab that means bootstrap is perfectly working fine in your application okay so the next thing is how we can be drive some components here so here you can see that uh, let me just try with some button right so this is the button and in login page we have this simple button so let me change this with the uh, some bootstrap button so there you can see that we have lots of button but i'll just use first one only and then we'll go to the login.blade.php and if i just change it and change this primary text with the login you'll see this is perfectly working fine so here you can see that we added this uh, bootstrap css and js file in the layout and they are working with the login right so after that maybe uh, you want to add some nav bar because we have the simplest header there right so yeah this is a really simplest header uh, then uh, we can maybe copy this code and in the layout file we can change it with the this ul and if i just paste it and then i'll check with the all other pages you can see that this is perfectly fine drop down button hover and everything is working fine yeah okay so the next thing is so let's say you want to add some some input also so let me just change their form control yeah so then maybe you can use any of these form components so let me just try to use this after that let's go to the login and change these things with there and here you can see that they are also perfectly working fine so this is not look like a input field so you can remove this plain class and maybe you can also remove the read only right let me save and you can see that now this is perfectly working fine right so with that way we can use the bootstrap uh, with the word laravel if you still have any confusion any doubt you can ask me in the comment section this is my paytm number for donation thank you guys thank you so much